Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the following question, and the question says: Calculate the money required to buy one three fifty twenty dollars shares at a premium of seven dollars. Part two: two seventy five sixty dollars shares at a discount of ten dollars. Part three. Fifty seventy-five dollar shares quoted at seventy-one point five zero dollars. Let's start the solution now. In part one, the number of shares to be bought is given to be three fifty. So, number of shares. to be bought is equal to 350 now 20 dollar shares at a premium of 7 dollars means the nominal value of the share is 20 dollars that is the original value of a share at which the company sells to investors is 20 dollars So nominal value of the share is equal to twenty dollars. Since the premium is given to be seven dollars, so the market value or the price at which stock is bought or sold is equal to the nominal value which is $20 plus the premium which is $7 and this is equal to $27 hence the money required to buy one share is equal to the market value of each share which is $27 we have to find the money required to buy 350 shares so therefore money required to buy 350 shares is equal to 350 into 27 dollars which is equal to 9450 dollars so this is the answer for part 1 now let's see part 2 We are given that the nominal value of each share is sixty dollars, and discount is ten dollars. So in part two, money required to buy one share is equal to the nominal value. which is $60 minus the discount which is $10 and this is equal to $50 now we have to find the money required to buy 275 shares so therefore money required to buy 275 shares is equal to 275 into $50 which is the money required to buy one share and this is equal to $13,750 this is the answer for part 2 Now in part three, we are given the nominal value of each share, 
which is $75 dollars and the quoted price which is $71.50 dollars. Now the quoted price of a share means its market value. So in part 3, we are given the quoted price or the market value of each share. So the money required to buy one share is equal to $71.50 dollars. We have to find the money required to buy 50 shares. So therefore, money required to buy 50 shares is equal to 50 into money required to buy one share which is $71.50 dollars and this is equal to $3,575 dollars. This is the answer for part 3. With this we end our session. Hope you enjoyed the session.